won't be able to watch the game because it'll be raining and everything on Sunday here. We have a little shot of rain coming our way. Good morning, guys. Good morning, everybody. And clear skies and dry conditions prevail. There's downtown San Francisco. Go on in here for, for you. Temperature check for you. We've got lots of 30s going on in the East Bay for right now and the North Bay, but we're going to see better warming up north today. 40 for San Jose and some 40s also lining up the East Bay shoreline. Nice little treat, almost a kind of a break with uh, winter, it looks like, at least for maybe today. Now, these offshore winds, another element I was talking about, reinforcing the dry air we have. You see Solano County up here. It does spread out a little bit to the East Bay and takes kind of a path right through the Carquina Strait and out to San Francisco, out to sea. Uh, this is somewhat more contained than its uh, predecessor was. It won't be as potent, but it'll just kind of reinforce some of the drier air that we've had. So, mostly sunny today, cool highs near 60s well inland. That should be plural 60s because we'll see maybe mid to upper 60s and a few selective spots. Going forward, Wednesday to finish off the week. Basically mostly sunny, uh, breezy late Wednesday today, then mild lower 60s going on inland. Now for this weekend, let's keep some scattered clouds on your Saturday. Temperatures already correcting for this new event because it's a cold system, not just rain, but cold. So that's more traditional to our winter type storm systems. It doesn't have with it as much in the way of rain as our previous systems were, so we shouldn't see a lot of problems with it and just adding some more snow up to Tahoe while we're at it. 62 San Francisco, 64 for Oakland and San Jose. The bigger board is treated to some of those popping numbers like 68 for Santa Rosa.